Girl, look. Oh, you had me fooled with your title. Look for her, Nancy. Girl, look. I, you had me fooled with your title. Uh, you had me fooled with your title. I thought you was really supporting me. And I listened to your video and I'm like, girl, what is you on? I don't know what you on for her, Nancy, but you weird. <laughs> girl, you was weird. And I see why Corbin Brown didn't want to fuck with you after you got that 500. Because, honey, girl, I watched that video and I'm like, what the fuck is you talking about? You about to get blocked. Yeah, four of her Nancy three times or whatever the fuck it is. Mrs. Kitty, get your girl. Get your girl and take her on with you. Because, hey, I, I ain't finna be on that. I don't want to start up no extra bullshit with nobody. <laughs> Lady, I don't even know you. You know what I mean? So whatever your gripe is with Kwame Brown and the form and the $500 and all that shit, let your gripe be your gripe. But whatever it is that I say on my platform, this is my perspective and my thoughts. And if you've only watched one or two of my videos, that is really a, a biased perspective that you have when you're doing a reaction video on one of my videos. And see, this is where people got the game fucked up at. See, this is what I don't understand. People are tagging me in some shit and I'm all for you tagging me in it. I'm going to see what you own. So I'm going to watch it, especially when it's at Life Talk with Rainy. So I'm going to see what you own. You know what I mean? Like, okay, why they tagging me in it? And I'm like, okay, you know, I'm expecting positivity, right? I don't go in with a negative perspective. I'm like, okay, but I'm, I'm expecting positivity. So I'm watching the video and I'm like, okay, it was cool. I liked it. And I even left the sweet comment like, oh, thank you, sis. That's what's up. And then towards the end, you just start throwing me off, lady. So I don't know. Maybe you need some practice or something. I don't know if you was showing me love and salute me. Or if you was calling me out, sneak dissing, but you was being positive from your perspective, okay? Because you was like, I can, you, you was like saying I can miss you with some shit and some stuff that I said about Charleston. Why? I'm like, where is she going with this? I was confused. <laughs> That's, I was confused. I'm sorry, I didn't get it. Long head, you know. I hope you got it because I saw you commented. I didn't get it. I don't know. Anyway. So just because somebody, and that's my thing, people have real biased perspectives because when you just see one a person's, like make maybe one or two uh, videos of a person and then you go make form a whole opinion about them, you're being really biased and you're doing yourself a disservice. You can't come over here and just because you see a motherfucking name in the title and you see one video of mine, up, up, or you see one time I misread a comment or one time I may go off on somebody or I may say something being sarcastic. If you're not going to watch a person and really see what their character is like, don't go making no motherfucking content about that person that you don't even know them. If you haven't watched and clicked through some of my videos to at least get a feel for my personality. It helps the speaker lead his audience into the scene he described by creating an imaginary picture. Usually it's something that moves. Wolfpack, what up? Wolfpack? Woof, woof. <laughs> Y'all gotta excuse my light. It just don't wanna cooperate today. So I'm looking frosty. Like I'm underneath the, the, the full moon. It's a full, I got a full moon in my living room. <laughs> her dance. Yeah, four of her dance three times or whatever the fuck it is. Mrs. Kitty, get your girl. Get your girl and take her on with you. I ain't hitting no motherfucking thing. Mrs. Skinny, get your girl. Yeah, get your girl. Better keep on over there with you now. I thought everything was clear. Mm -hmm. What? Never. Wolf talk with rain dance. <laughs> 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 It's okay, we're not gonna play by the rules, all right? Here, no, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do the Big Sean song. Wait, wait, we are? 
Yeah, mom's working on it, okay? So yes. I'll follow your lead and you. Can... The moves are the same, right? The whole. Yeah, yeah, oh, we... yeah. The moves... you... There it goes. Okay, yeah. we gotta go. Okay, we gotta let's go. Let's, do let's, do go. let's go. Trisha, this song is for you. I don't fuck with you. You little stupid ass bitch, I ain't fucking with you. You little, you little dumb ass bitch, I ain't fucking with you. I got a million trillion things that I'd rather fucking do. Alright, fuck it, that's what we're doing, alright. Then I be fucking with you. Little stupid ass, I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck, I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck, bitch, I don't give a fuck about you. Don't give a fuck about Who's you or anything that you do. Okay. Who's the loser now, Trisha? Bully this bitch. Oh my. I was unaware of the lyrics and the strong language in that song, so I do apologize. But uh, you know what? Uh, I apologize for nothing else. Self. So when that motherfucker, even though it's helping y'all, y'all feel like y'all getting y'all getting crumbs off a big ass feast table, nigga. So at the end of the day, she's still gonna be lit. Y'all nigga, Chicky's channel, Magruder dick, like all the, all the clown niggas is here, nigga. Clown convention. Who would lie? Try to take a nigga down. Try to use false information to fucking to, to turn people against a nigga all because you jealous and you hate. Um, you don't got morals for no other shit, but you got morals for this. Fuck out of it. That don't make sense, nigga. A bitch ass nigga is a bitch ass nigga is a bitch ass nigga. Nigga, if you can hate, try to take down a nigga that helped you. What you think? Cornbread is the only one on the hook? Nah, bruh. Because cornbread wasn't the only one fucking in them chats, fucking um supporting that Armando don't do that shit that he doing where he's lying and slandering nigga. It wasn't just content creators standing up for that. It was motherfucking subscribers too. So I got all y'all niggas name. I know all who was in the chats fighting against that shit. And I watch all you motherfuckers in the chat that was there when we was fighting against that shit right along with Cornbread and ain't say shit. Now all you niggas names coming out, you niggas gonna have to explain why is it okay for Cornbread to call me a motherfucking pedophile, but we don't, we don't support that type of shit. I'm putting you niggas names out here. Oh, and Farmer Nancy, is this what we doing? Farmer Nancy... Do we allow niggas to call other niggas pedophiles because you don't like them? Because you got a bigger page, you got a following, and I need to know if this is what um, farmers support. I want to know if this was farmers support. Because I heard a lot of things about people on farms. I heard people fuck sheep, goats, pigs. Heard niggas sleep with the fucking animals on farms. Is that is that true for you? Have you ever had a horse put his dick up in you? Because they do that on farms. I've seen that shit on video, nigga. Would I be able to go on one of these motherfucking woman fucking horse 
Would I be able to see a farmer Nancy on one of them motherfucking videos? Or do you know somebody that's been fucked by a horse before? You telling me you ain't hear one story of a nigga fucking a sheep on a farm where you grew up. You ain't hear one story of a bitch getting fucked by a horse on a farm where you grew up. You tell him you ain't never heard them stories. You ain't never heard them stories on a farm about niggas fucking the animals. You telling me you ain't never heard of that? You telling me there wasn't one person ever around all these farms. You ain't here. Yo, that nigga over there done fucked a sheep before. Yo, that nigga done got caught fucking a pig. You telling me you ain't never hear not one of those stories. You a fucking liar if you don't. If you try to tell me you ain't never heard those stories about a farm. If you ain't telling me that there wasn't one, at least one person in your motherfucking life that you done heard that, heard that story about. You's a motherfucking liar. Because you know what comes with living on a motherfucking farm. Those stories. Those stories come with living on a farm. So now, would you like that because I know this type of shit happens on a farm, that Farmer Nancy is the bitch getting fucked with horse dick? Because it's hot, it's possible. It's not like you could say, that could never happen. Yes, it can happen, nigga. Bitches on farms fuck horses. Fuck you mean. Are you one of them kind of bitches on the farm that fuck horses? That's all I'm saying. You wouldn't. Oh, okay. Well, hey, you in the chat? <laughs> you seem like you seem like you okay with this type of shit. You know what I mean? And uh, shit, man. Listen. Anyway, anyway, this what they promote. This what they promote. I'm saying. You fuck around. You live in a barn. <laughs> Oh man, listen, listen, Linda, listen. Bro, it's not like it ain't a thing. And mind you, it's not a thing for a nigga like me who is in a city or a woman that's in a city. Why? Because we don't got no fucking farm. People that fuck animals and horses and shit like that, they're not people like me because I don't have access to that shit. But people like you who got access to that shit might try it. So it's not like, even, even when I'm speaking on it, nigga, you can't put it on nobody like me. Nobody around me, nigga. But I could definitely put it on you because I search right now with a woman fucking a horse and I bet you it's nothing but barn videos and farm videos. They ain't fucking a horse in no city. These horse ain't fucking these women in no motherfucking um, suburbs. They out on a motherfucking farm, nigga, in the middle of nowhere. Fucking horses. Fucking sheeps and fucking pigs. On acres and acres and acres of fucking land. So it's places where you from that people fuck horses. That women take that horse dick and put it in their motherfucking vagina. It's places where you from. And if you Google it right now, all you're going to see is farms. You ain't going to see no motherfucker on a city street getting fucked by a horse. Every time you see that shit, it's going to be on a farm, Farmer Nancy. So don't try to tell me that you don't know that women on farms are fucking horses. I just hope that you ain't one of them, but I can't say that you ain't. You love that farm so much, you probably love them horses. But anyway, this type, this type of slander is unacceptable. It's unacceptable. But I'm going to just let it play out so y'all can hear all the fuck shit they were saying. And then I'm going to move on. Now, where is Farmer Nancy saying something outside of over here? Clarity? Hmm. Well, I don't know any of you guys <laughs> to um, care, you know what I'm saying? 
But I did hear a lot of the foul things that were coming out of Sis's mouth about Lonnie. You know what I'm saying? And damn, I'm sorry y'all excuse the fuck out of me. You know what I'm saying? The content that I was seeing from Sis was the Sunday services and you know what I'm saying? The little drops and stuff, the little wabbit drops he was doing and shit. And I mean, he can say I'm lying. If he wants to, but shit, I would comment on the shit or, you know, hit the like, you know, so, you know, it is what it is. When I go somewhere else to Lonnie's page, yes, that's where I was at. And obviously they have a, there's no communication there. There's a situation there. We can see it. And God damn it. Everybody is revisiting. Let's fucking revisit. You know what I'm saying? So let's revisit how farmer nancy became uh <laughs> a joke y'all thought this was funny this was a jokey joke now look now look sis wants his name cleared she called him a liar i never called him epstein y'all running around here saying i called him Epstein as if I was y'all heard me out my mouth say damn that nigga says is, is Epstein I never said that I never said that let us take a look make this shit big I mean Lonnie played some shit where Sis was going off. I mean, she was fat bitches. I'm, I'm not. I don't even want to repeat that shit. All I'ma say is it was mad disrespectful, and that's my opinion. I felt like it was disrespectful. You know what I'm saying? I really wasn't paying attention too much to what Cornbread and Matthew was saying. I don't know them like that, and shit, Matthew be funny, and I think he was calling him Liz with a wrench or some shit like that. That shit was funny. The shit that y'all laughed at, are y'all serious? But y'all wanted to pull people out the chat. No. Sis, this was all for the love of rainy because <laughs> i was on the top because bitch i don't fuck with you and you you sit your little hound dog down on me it's cool it was cute you know what i'm saying but since y'all out here giving straightenings let's give some straightenings trace spec this what what's the problem at one point in time, I was a supporter too. <laughs> Welcome to the party. This is the summer motherfucking revival. Y'all out here tripping. And I don't got time to be on here too long, so I don't want to hold y'all. You know what I'm saying? I just want to get to it. Hold on. Let's see. Let's watch this chat. In the morning, so. Bam. There we go. Right here. Now, I think y'all got to go do y'all own research. So I don't got time for all of that and whatever he had going on with Cornbread, whatever. I'm I'm taking on account the shit that he be saying. And I, I don't know no man that be on here talking so violently towards women. That's just me. Whatever. Y'all can take it how y'all want it. It is what it is. Nigga, you sharing your content. Nigga was hitting a like, dropping comments on your shit. But then I did hear some foul shit. Now, Evar May, I don't give a fuck about the context and the story time and to hear what the story is i don't fucking care like i don't know no grown-ass man that's really real and really I, I, I don't know how you transfer that i don't know how you had that type of attitude for bitches on the internet and i could just imagine how you're like with females in real life that come at you that's just me bro Re you know what i'm saying y'all want bitches to respect y'all mind respect my mind respect the fucking game Stop running around here spinning stories, making lies, spreading lies, and then y'all over there want a motherfucker to just believe what y'all saying. Y'all holding Holy Ghost Church. Stop. Y'all gotta be, y'all can't be serious. This shit right here says, see, let us find out. He from Epstein Island. Because they kept saying he just doing all of this talking 
such aggressive talking. Is that saying he is from Epstein Island? No. It says, let us find out. I don't fucking know him like that. But he's saying some very vile things. He's talking about some very deviant things. That's my fucking opinion. It didn't have nothing. And then that's so disingenuous. Ain't he saying you being disingenuous? He just told brown skin lady, how you going to ask me that? How you going to, if you ask me why you don't respect Mr. Skinny, why you respect Mr. Skinny more than you respect T.Y. Sid Straight was like, that's a lie. She's lying. It would have been more genuine to, for, of her to ask me, do you have more respect for Mr. Skinny than you do T.Y.? Exactly, my nigga. You just said that I don't didn't like you. I didn't know you to like you or not like you. So how can you out your mouth say, is this what we support when you don't like somebody? What? Who said that? You made this shit up. Not only did you make it up, I said let us find out. And then as y'all can see right here, it says... CC, I ain't want to say it. Oh, man. Because I ain't want to say it. Because I'm like, damn. You know what I'm saying? This is crazy. Because I don't really get deep into this kind of content. Y'all have a, the way where y'all get up on here and talk about pedophilia and all kind of deviancies. That's what y'all do. I'm just in the chat. I'm a spectator. But you wanted to pull me out the chat for content. Is that what you wanted to do? On behalf of Rainy, you wanted me to shit, sit down, sit back, and shut the fuck up. Okay. Well, now look at y'all. Y'all not sitting down, sitting back, and shutting the fuck up. <laughs> y'all gonna talk about her for forever, however long it's gonna take. Uh, I'll name my neck. <laughs> Man, that's funny as shit. Let's look. Anyway, let's hear these niggas. Let's, let's hear. He said, let's hear. Who did did y'all hear Farmer Nancy say that? Uh, y'all didn't. Y'all didn't. Y'all didn't. And y'all just saw what I said. See, let us find out. He's from Epstein Island. CC. I ain't want to say it. Oh, man. <laughs> Did y'all see that chat? I'm recording this and then I'm going to put it on my stream yard and then I'm going to re-review re it. Mm, 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 mm. I, want, I want this to go away because I want to see. I want royal. I want royal. Y'all got it, y'all. You just a long time ago here, the whole conversation. I, like, I, like, I don't want to play it because I don't. I, <laughs> that was back then. I just wanted to show how y'all is the hypocrisy out here in these streets, man. It's really, 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 really real. And y'all got to stop this shit. Really do. <laughs> so I just said, I just said, Empress and interrogated. I shut my mouth now. Hold on, hold on. Who in here? CC? Farmer Nancy? Ash Kiro Moxie? You stalking me? I can't go so. We always have. Hold on. Magruder Dick? Ooh, we all, all, the, all the clown niggas is here, nigga. Clown convention. I so why am I a clown? Because. I, I support Lonnie. I have to be a clown. You don't fucking know me like that. <laughs> like, look, look, look at the way y'all people act and the way y'all people go about y'all's day. Like, I'm sorry, but the video that Lonnie played where you were screaming at her at the top of your lungs, calling her all these type of derogatory names and saying all that shit, it don't have nothing to do with the fact that it was Lonnie. It's the fact that she was a woman she is a woman I, I, I i've never not in my real life have i ever observed a man talk to a woman like that so observing it happen on youtube was baffled it's so aggressive i i think that i can have that opinion 
I have to be a clown for that? Your issue is with cornbread and whatever the fuck y'all had going on in y'all discord and all that kind of shit. I was just collateral, collateral damage and you thought you had caught a body for your bitch. Now your bitch out here making you a body for the next nigga. I don't want to say stuff like that because it's unnecessary. We, we don't have to do that. It just is what it is. You know what I'm saying? It just is what the fuck it is. But subscribers promote slander and, and support hate. Where the fuck was y'all at when the nigga Kwame Brown was slandering my small business? <laughs> what you mean? Y'all was a part of the subscribers that was like, Farmer Nancy's just begging or blah, blah, blah. Like, come on, bro. Y'all y'all is funny. Y'all is funny. Anyways, you know, that was a question for people that cared, I guess. <laughs> but we revisiting things. And, you know, I, I just want everybody to, you know, just keep it 100. Like, what story? I didn't need to hear no story. You was like... I only hear half the story and blah. What is, what's the, I did, I wasn't watching his content like that. I wasn't say I was watching the little clippy shorts. You know, I wasn't involved all deep like that for the fucking rabbit kingdom and shit like that. That shit is bro. That's just me though. You know what I'm saying? I like it. I review y'all shit. I react to y'all shit. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But now that y'all are here with Rainy after obviously Y'all had a problem with me feeling the same fucking way that y'all feel now. Like, look at how, look at how weird y'all are, right? Now, y'all all have a problem with her the same way I had a problem with her. The disrespect of the supporters for no reason. She just fly off the lid. She say any random fucking thing and disregard people. Like, I've been saying that. I couldn't defend myself against Rainy. Sis had to come. He had to figure out a way. Watching, watching, watching. I can't wait till that bitch say something and throw. It's even close. Maybe. Maybe he just really felt the way that I said that shit. Let us find out. See, let us find out. That's not me saying he is there, that, or he is from there, from the island. I didn't call him the man. But that warranted this. I'm putting you niggas names out here. Oh, and Farmer Nancy, is this what we doing? Farmer Nancy, do we allow niggas to call other niggas pedophiles because you don't like them? Because you got a bigger page, you got a following, and I need to know if this is what um, farmers support. I mean, I could call out everybody in here in this chat. Is this what, you know what I'm saying? Y'all would support? Damn, attacking a black farmer. I'm already, you know what I'm saying? A unicorn out here in these streets. Bitch just trying to make it. You know what I'm talking about? He act like a bitch was out here trying to go to war with him. Oh, but this is fucking overseas calling him derogatory things. What did I, what derogatory thing did I call him? Let us find out he from Epstein Island. Is that calling him a name? Did I call him that? I want to know if this was farmers support because I heard a lot of things about people on farms. I heard people fuck sheep, goats, pigs, heard niggas sleep with. See, he started off straight. He heard. This is what you heard. Okay. Well, you hear shit. I, I ain't really out here listening to hear that kind of shit. I don't know. What the fuck? I'm not looking for it to find out. Can animals on farms? Is that is that true for you? Have you ever had a horse put his dick up in you? Cause they do that on farms. I've seen that shit on video, nigga. Now listen, y'all. How how am I wrong for being like, damn? After hearing the things he said on the video, 
towards Lonnie. I, I don't want to bring her because it's towards a woman. And I know, you know, it is what it is, you know. But at the end of the day, I ain't never heard no man. Like, I be hearing the niggas out here on the corner argue with these bitches. And that's crazy. <laughs> Oh man, this is this is we outside. Would I be able to tomorrow's Friday to go on one of these motherfucking woman fucking horse? Would I be able to see a farmer Nancy on one of them motherfucking video? Now, this is where everybody over there is out of line right now today while they trying to get some straightening. He says, Would I be able to go? onto some site i guess he know about those i don't know i'm not saying you do i'm just saying this is what we talking about and be able to see a farmer nancy on it so now he's putting me in that position he's not saying is she from a place like that no he's putting me there i didn't put him there on the island i just said let's find out and then I said, I ain't even want to say that shit. Uh, he didn't have an immediate damn, I shouldn't say these things. Or he didn't say, you know, mm, okay, come on. Or do you know somebody that's been fucked by a horse before? You telling me you ain't hear one story of a nigga fucking a sheep on a farm where you grew up? No, I <laughs> I saw that show Black Mirror with that very first episode, but they wasn't on the farm, and I don't look for that. I that's not where my I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You ain't hearing one story of a bitch getting fucked by a horse on a farm where you grew up. You tell them you ain't never heard them stories. You ain't never heard them stories on a black mirror on black mirror, but not in my life. No, sir. I'm sorry. <laughs> the fuck? No, nigga. Farm about niggas fucking the animals. You telling me you ain't never heard of that? You telling me? Yes, it's called bestiality. They talk about it in the Bible. It's against the laws of the Lord. There wasn't one person ever around all these farms. You ain't here. Yo, that nigga over there done fucked a sheep before. Yo. Look at heck money. <laughs> this is what he's saying I was doing. Oh my God, wow. That nigga done got caught fucking a pig. You telling me you ain't never hear not one of those stories. You a fucking liar if you don't. If you try to tell me you ain't never heard those. Well, I'm glad I cleared up that I seen it on Black Mirror. That first episode with the prime minister and the pig. I had seen that. So, I'm, you know what I'm saying? First of all, you approached me in January like we talked. And you just could ask me these questions. Just try. You talk. You came to me like I'll be out here hopping around, <laughs> talking to everybody. Come on, sir. All right. Stories about a farm. If you ain't telling me that there wasn't one, at least one person in your motherfucking life that you done heard that heard that story about, you's a mother. Heard it about somebody in my life. Come on, y'all are weird. Like he's sitting up here saying that I, I you haven't heard the story about one person in your life that didn't know what? Hold the fuck up. No, this is throat. You telling me there wasn't one person ever around all these farms. You ain't here. Yo, that nigga over there done fucked a sheep before. Yo. That nigga done got caught fucking a pig. You telling me you ain't never hear not one of those stories. You a fucking liar if you don't. If you try to tell me you ain't never heard those stories about a farm. If you ain't telling me that there wasn't one, at least one person in your motherfucking life that you done heard that, heard that story about. You a mother. Heard the story about. No. And you're a, you're a liar. And you wait across the border because no. I No. No. Uh, no.
I don't live around a lot of farmers. My farm's in the city, sir. You're a fucking liar. Because you know what comes with living on a motherfucking farm. Those stories. Those stories come with living on a farm. So now, would you like that because I know this type of shit happens on a farm, that farmer Nancy is the bitch getting fucked with horse dick? What? See, Yvonne, man, I told you, I don't know nothing about the backstory and the cornbread and the discord. You want me to know all of that. I'm not that nosy. I don't need to go all that far deep into that. Like I said, just hearing him say the things that he was saying, like y'all take joy in listening to men talk to women. I, all of that is this, this YouTube shit is throw. Okay. So I'm sorry that I didn't go for the backstory and that bothered you and i'm sorry that right now y'all are going through what y'all are going through on account of rainy and sis playing these internet games like what what about what about my name what about my character what about the defamation of me oh okay Because it's how it's possible. It's not like you could say that could never happen. Yes, it can happen. Nigga, bitches on farms fuck horses. Fuck you, mean. Are you one of them kind of bitches on the farm that fuck horses? That's all I'm saying. No. <laughs> no. You wouldn't. Oh, okay. Well, hey, you in the chat. <laughs> So because I'm in the chat, then that makes me a bitch that fucks horses. What? This is definitely the Wabbit King. <laughs> Goddamn. King of the wild. <laughs> you seem like you seem like you okay with this type of shit. It seems like it. That's a fallacy. You you making that up. How does it seem like it? See, you don't, you just was throwing things out there. You was trying to throw me out there under the bus. You was trying to pop, 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 Trying to light my ass up. Light that ass up. Hey, light that ass up. You was trying to light my ass up. Eh, eh. Can't get me behind a good line, boss. Eh, eh. <laughs> Stop it. You know what I mean? And, uh, shit, man, listen. Anyway, anyway, this is what they promote. This is what they promote. I'm saying. You fuck around. You live in a barn. <laughs> oh, man. Listen. Listen, Linda. Listen. Bro, it's not like it ain't a thing. And mind you, it's not a thing for a nigga like me who is in a city or a woman that's in a city. Why? Because we don't got no fucking farm. And that's so sad because in the black community, how we feeding ourselves, we inner city people, ain't no farms. <laughs> that's nutrition oppression, sis, to not have no farms inside the city and urban communities where the black people are marginalized and vulnerable. Y'all hungry. This why right here, y'all on the internet talking to each other like this. And I'm just trying to find out if people is from some island where it's, it's fucking, what's the word? Uh, We've been using for this shit. Deviance. Deviance. Just deviance. It don't have to be sexual deviance. It can just be deviance. Lying upon people. Being mischievous. You know what I'm saying? Damn, my nigga. You tried to drag a bitch. You tried to drag a city farmer. Damn. I'm sorry that it's not no farms in your city. I apologize. I want to try to be a blueprint, a prototype, and help with that. It's it's not just me. It's a lot of us out here. You know what I'm saying? I could see my people. Hook up with my people. I be I be sharing information about my people. Oh man. People that fuck animals have access to that shit. 
but you ain't never hear not one of those stories you are hey you in the chat <laughs> you seem like you seem like you okay with this type of shit you know what i mean and uh shit man listen anyway anyway this what they promote this what they promote i'm saying you fuck around you live in a barn <laughs> Oh man, listen, listen, Linda, listen. Bro, it's not like it ain't a thing. And mind you, it's not a thing for a nigga like me who is in a city or a woman that's in a city. Why? Because we don't got no fucking farm. People that fuck animals and horses and shit like that, they're not people like me because I don't have access to that shit. Mmm, heck, money said I was drilling donkey. I see you, Queenie. You like, okay, 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 sis. Like, all right. But he, y'all should have made him show y'all. Y'all should have made him really show y'all where I said that he was Epstein. Y'all, y'all can't fucking do that. Y'all can't do me like that. That's not cool. Now y'all know y'all wrong. Y'all know everybody. I want to be. I. Right, that's y'all wrong. Transpectives. Look at you out here. She kicked me out. She blocked me. Why did she do this to me? Oh my God, no. Nigga, she sick sins on me. She sent her guard dog for me. And y'all ate this shit up. That's sad. This was sad. This was just so sad. But people like you who got access to that shit might try it. So it's not like even even when I'm speaking on it, nigga, you can't put it on nobody like me. Nobody around me, nigga. But so I guess maybe he thought I was going to come out and try to be like, no, nigga, that's you, blah, blah, blah. Try to flip it. No, I was so, I was like, damn, that's cold. You know what I'm saying? And I ain't even really blame him. I blame that bitch, Rainy. Because she ain't want to, you know what I'm saying? She want to hide. But y'all, y'all out here saying it. She hiding behind all the men and turning them crazy. She got them out here doing the most. Gotta be, man. Now y'all out here saying, oh, come on, y'all. Come on, y'all. We doing revisionist history. Let We got to revisit. And the only reason we got to revisit is because she brought my name up. And she said that I called him Epstein. Come on now. Did I? This. That's like they was in the chat and I said, yeah, y'all know he Epstein. <laughs> no, that's not the case. And so when y'all want to break shit down all night, five hours, like, come on, bro. Let's be, let's, let's keep it a hundred. But I could definitely put it on you because I search right now with a woman fucking a horse and I bet you it's nothing but barn videos and farm videos. They ain't fucking a horse in no city. Why would he want to search that? But thank you for saying that because I am in the city. So he vindicated me. So it was like he was kind of doing like a double entendre. So I couldn't be really that mad. You know what I'm saying? Because it's like, damn, nigga, you don't know shit about me. You know what I'm saying? that That's what made it clear that he was just running off at the mouth. You know, just kind of like, I, I'm sure he felt some kind of way. He was just trying to make a point. But I mean, damn, it's like I don't I didn't want supporting it. I mean, what the fuck? Damn, y'all trying to bully niggas out the chat. Y'all trying to bully people's thoughts. Y'all trying to bully a motherfucker and not say what they think. I can, I didn't even think. I was like, damn, let me find out he from there. Epstein Island. Fuck the shit. Island of Deviants. I don't fucking know. Look at what y'all doing on here. These horse ain't fucking these women in no motherfucking um, suburbs. They out on a motherfucking farm, nigga, in the middle of nowhere. Fucking horses, fucking sheep, and fucking pigs. Look, uh, Ivame, I was sick of stories being told when you ain't never been a fly on a wall either. Shit, y'all was over here. Y'all wasn't no fly on a wall in my mind when I was <laughs> when I was listening to that shit. I like, damn, I ain't never heard a man talk like this before about no woman. He going to fuck off. All that other shit, cornbread, and then was talking about. I don't, I don't know them. I'm not all in fucking shit. God, y'all want motherfuckers to be down in the depths, in the pits of the muck. Jesus Christ. Mm. 
on acres and acres and acres of fucking land. So it's places where you from that people fuck horses. That women take that horse dick and put it in their motherfucking vagina. It's places where you from. And if you Google it right now, all you're going to see is farms. You ain't going to see no motherfucker in a city. Look at Rainy. This is why she can forever get it. Cause I, she put him up to this shit. They was on the phone, and he was like, "She was like, did you see Mommy Nancy call you a pedophile?" <laughs> it's already dark, calling him a pedo. Like, <laughs> what the fuck, bitch? Nobody ever did that. Not over here. Not, not over here. You know. Based upon what I hear from y'all on YouTube. The things that be being said about women and them being scum and bottom of the earth bitches, nasty whores, and taking like, oh my god, oh my, oh my gosh, like, I'm sorry, but to me, that's just screaming deviance, like, and shit. Them islands be used for deviance. Any kind. I don't know, it might be a murder island. It could be a fucking purge island. I don't know. I don't give a fuck. But don't be trying to say that I'm calling people things when I'm not. Y'all are liars. Like I've been saying. Rainy's the, the head liar in charge to gas up the next liar. And here come the group of liars. Y'all just mad because y'all ain't in the lie club no more. Like got kicked out the weirdo club that's what she told charles the white <laughs> the fuck city street getting fucked by a horse every time you see that shit it's gonna be on a farm farmer nancy so don't try to tell me that you don't know that women on farms you fucking horses i don't know that i don't i'm sorry <sighs> Oh, man. I just hope that you ain't one of them, but I can't say that you ain't. Y'all see this? Y'all see this? I want my name clear. You know what I'm saying? I want my name clear, nigga. Yes, you can say that I'm not, bitch, because I'm better than that. Sorry, I mean to call you that, but you know what I'm saying? You're not right. That was, that was, this was cold. <laughs> Especially only for y'all to be over there doing what y'all doing now to Rainy. Like, come on, man. This is a full circle. You love that farm so much. I do love my urban farm because it's in the city where farms aren't normally yet in order to feed vulnerable and marginalized, unhoused people that look like me. Oopsies. You probably love them horses. I don't have no horses, but Gilbert Arenas did send me a cow. And I do love my cow, Zella. She's a nice little beef cow, black body. She's a year old now. But anyway, this type, this type of slander is unacceptable. It's this type of slander is unacceptable. Why, why was he able to slander me like this and be out here talking about a bitch probably taking donkey dick? Like, what? Oh, my God. Like... <laughs> Uh, this was his clap back, y'all. It's unacceptable. But I'm going to just let it play out so y'all can hear all the fuck shit they were saying. And then I'm going to move on. All this fuck shit, nigga. You can say whatever the fuck. That's cornbread. You know, I was just over here. You see me had the cornbread. <laughs> Look, I was like, oh, shit, cornbread, nigga. They was tripping. Nigga, me, I was really talking to Cece in the chat. That's who I really was talking to. Me and her be talking. She be passing me notes. You know what I'm saying? Don't be passing me notes in the chat, girl. See, see, you got me in fucking trouble. You be <laughs> passing me notes. Yeah, y'all, man, listen to the things that come out these people's mouths. You know what I'm saying? Uh, here's because here's why. What brought me here? Shout out to the church. Salutes to the church. Salutes to the church. I was I was really looking for that video too. Did this shit here? This is recent. 
But no, you need to go think about stuff that I've done before. Fair use, fair use, y'all. This is recent. So uh they doing a revisionist history. Uh I guess Rainy is like Rainy is like Rainy is upset because sis was letting brown skin lady and all these people up on his panel and she feel like that's fucked up. What if I went and I got cornbread and Lonnie and all these people and farmer Nancy, she was calling you a pedo. No, and that's a lie. What what the fuck? I I already went through that so that when I did this, I could just be done. I want to make sure this was like less than an hour, but we ain't make it. But whatever. Four. Listen to these crazy ass fucking people, y'all. They they need to get the fuck off the internet. I I'ma grow. I need to find something to grow. I'm growing a loofah so we can sponge the deviants away. What the fuck? Just how they chose to handle it. I respect these people for how Why you didn't handle it right? You know what I hate? You know what I hate about this heifer? And hate is a bad word. Tell us really. I I don't like I, I hate her attitude. Me too. I said that. I'm going to say that. The personality. Mm-hmm. She want people to just... So what? Should I call you fake? I can see you ain't shit. I've been calling and her fake and she ain't been shit. You need to come and beg me for my forgiveness. You need to come beg me. You need to come beg me. And I could let you in. mm 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 She got problems. She do. I've the been world telling y'all. Like that. It don't. And I was telling y'all that. Just because you put on a goddamn blazer, you expect, oh, okay. It and since attack me. From YouTube or Google. That say I'm a life coach. Now get out of my way. Now I'm a life coach. Girl, bye. Please. Now y'all know, I know, as a grown ass person, better than that. I don't motherfucking know that, man. <laughs> And I don't know, Cornbread, I don't know none of them people to just be out here believing that. He ain't dropped no paperwork. He ain't do no, no, look at this information, no, none of that. He was just talking shit, a man scorned. And I'm like, damn, the way y'all going in, what the fuck? But, yes, based upon the things I had heard him saying when it comes to his back and forth with, with Lonnie, yes, I... I fucking can come to that conclusion like listen to this shit it just go on and on and on i mean on and on and on you need a life coach you really do you need a real life coach so they can tell you about yourself they're choosing to handle it you want to be mad then stay mad but but the simple fact of the matter is to, to, to just drag it out and make it seem like what i did was so extreme and to the point where like, Welcome to the party. Nothing else gets called out. Nothing else gets called out. The only thing that's the focal point when it comes to me now is this motherfucking block. And so, I call them fake. We're not going yep. to talk about... I've been saying know, that, karma. I told y'all. Oh, okay. She want to make it seem like, oh, she called me a bitch. She said I was in love with Sid. But you're not going to talk about the fact that I've opened my panel up to you in full support when Tilda was dogging you out. When Lonnie was dogging you out. When we was behind the scenes, I was the support. But my point is, you're we we gonna forget all of that. You so, make me go so all of that type of shit. You know what I'm saying? We're not gonna talk about the fact that me and I respected the hell out of simply Erica. Certain we had to make me want to go But simply Erica, oh Lord, child, came to me behind the scenes and said, "Ray, can skinny. you just please not even speak on my name because I don't even want problems with them." I deleted everything that I, every video and every comment and I was like, cool, you don't want me to speak on my name? I can just unknow you. So since we want to paint it out to be over a fucking block and I called you fake where nothing that I've ever done was good, nothing that I've ever, no support that I've ever given, okay, fine then. You know what I'm saying? Because when I said what I had to say, I moved the fuck on. You don't hear me Hello. constantly making lies about these people. You don't hear me constantly going on and on about these people. So my point about your question, my answer to your question, it don't matter what percentage was of YouTube or not. The bottom line was this. When you consider yourself my friend, like I said, if I was to open my panel up to the real cornbread, Hollywood. Ooh, they having a struggle over there. Hold on. Cole, before Cole. I even get. Before. Oh, really be hating. Why you always stopping to take when she about to talk about for Nancy? Oh, let me get there. Let me address something. 
she's going to say, she says, she was such a good friend to Trey Spector. Tell us, Pastor. When Sister T went off and she was a good a good friend. Right? Okay, I'll give you that. You such a good friend. Man, y'all got took for the okie dog. I got to listen through this shit. Woo! That fast for it's like the church gone bad. You call this woman a fake supporter. Call her bitch. Accuse her for wanting tears. Man, this bitch called me weird. She said I was a fake farmer. She said up there with Sis. And she said I called. She lied and said that I said he was that. And I never did that. Oh, my God. And y'all all ate it up only to be turning around, calling her out, saying that she's a liar and a play pretender. Join the club. <laughs> and you think she need to not worry about that. She need to go back and just remember about the good times. You remember when I opened up my piano for you? Now, I, I know I did this shit here. This is recent. But no, you need to go think about stuff that I've done before. Mind you, Transpective is a supporter, a paid member, stay sending her. Listen, man, I was a supporter of Brandy too. That was before she had paid memberships and all that bullshit. All I could do was hit the light and you know what I'm saying? Comment or some shit. <laughs> Ah, uh, y'all let her blow up, and she did y'all damn bad. That stuff. And you want this woman to throw all that what you did recent, and just think about what well, she did. Let me on that panel and uh, talk about um, how I feel with Tilda did. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna, I'm going to X out that what she called me, and I'm gonna focus just on the time when I was on that panel. Yeah. Bitch, what life you live in? What world are you from? Who is you? A play pretend one. I've been saying that. That's what I want to know. Who are you? I be want to know who all y'all is. You not making no sense. No sense. Someone can hug on me and love me today and do me so good. And the next day, if that goddamn sucker cut me, Cut me deep. You mean to tell me I got to don't worry about that. Don't worry about how they cut you. They they cut you good. I need you to go back and think about when they uh hugged you and 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 they showed you such a nice time. Nigga, where where, where they do that at? Oh, uh, y'all gotta make y'all minds up. Y'all keep moving the goalposts like what the fuck? I felt the kind of way. I mean, at the end of the day, all the fucking analogies come down to the bottom line. Motherfucker, say some shit to you that's out of line and you feel away. You know what I'm saying? And when you motherfucking feel away about something that they say, especially if what the fuck they saying is defaming you, slandering you. And some shit like that, you're gonna have them in your sights. You're gonna have some shit to say back to them. That's it. I don't know why I gotta take five hours to talk about this kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? I've been saying this bitch been doing this shit for like a long time. And so now that we're here, oh, it was exhausting. Y'all gonna get exhausted. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I don't I, I don't feel like he should have felt no kind of way about what I said because one, I don't know him. He don't know me. I'm I'm not no subscriber out here spreading shit. I didn't leave Lonnie's chat and go talk about him. He left Lonnie's chat and went and talked about me. I wasn't slandering him. I said, let us find out he from Epstein Island. That's not fucking slander. Now, me saying that he is, that's some fucking slander shit. Y'all like to move the goalposts and fix shit the way y'all want it to sound so y'all can try to cherry pick who y'all want to have problems with. He just cherry picked me because at the time, I was making that bitch Rainy cry. And she was probably talking about me to him and he got tired of hearing that motherfucking shit. Just go off on that bitch. <laughs> What the fuck, man? Listen to y'all. You delusional. Don't you know when you did that? Y'all delusional. To her? All that other shit got cut out. Because you know what? Oh, shit. I need you to go back. 
See what Kobe saying? She was mad about that rabbit trial and went live saying she was going to divide the room. And anyone that said her and says needed to talk, she was tripping and got blocked. Oh. Associated. Just play the you shit. No nigga just playing. I'm gonna get I'm not gonna get too far from myself. You don't get One too far from yourself, sure. Pastor. Don't bring yourself. I had to go take this a bath and break get away with it. She thinks she's doing something. She thinks she's doing something. You want to revisit shit? That's what happened. You see, you're mad because that revisiting, if Sis revisit or anybody revisit, the truth coming out. And that's why Farming Ends is here to revisit for you niggas so that the truth can come out. So that all of y'all can be like, yeah, that was, huh? Yeah, that y'all was out of motherfucking line. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm gonna be a therapist. Let's, let's work this out. Guess what? I'm pretty sure, and I'm asking him, hey, yo, Sid, come up on my panel and talk to the real cornbread after he called you a child predator. Mm. Right? Come up here. If I let Foreman Nancy up there, after Foreman Nancy called you Epstein, me and her cool. Now, pause. Y'all just heard her lie. I did not call him Epstein. I didn't call him that. But she's spreading lies to Mr. Skinny. Everybody in Mr. Skinny chat listening to the lies. These are the motherfucking lies. Ooh, now, right? Come up on my panel, talk to former Nancy. Oh, the you the only one want to be the revisit. So you can put your own spin and your own stuff and say whatever you want. No, nigga, it don't work like that. It don't work like that. Once you open a door up, guess what? Niggas coming through that door. Not gonna let you speak on shit. Oh no, it's not gonna happen. It's not gonna happen. Cannot play with you. You're not playful. And you know, men. That's because she makes shit up. Well, certain men do like to at least be playful with their girlfriend. They love to, or with their friend. You know, they calm a little bit, act a little silly. I'm gonna be a therapist. Let's, let's work this out. Guess what? I'm pretty sure. And I'm asking him, hey, yo, Sid, come up on my panel and talk to the real cornbread after he called you a child. If I let Foreman Nancy up there, after 25358. 25358. 25358. Yeah, I gotta show me where I, I called him. I called. <laughs> Y'all are liars. Oh, you can't say nothing to that one. You can't climb with that one. So, what, what are they gonna do? You're not fun. I told you that before. You're not fun. You're not fun. She not fun. I've been saying that. I've been saying y'all thought, hey, man, y'all said I was weird. Listen, I made some fun fucking content for her. Y'all remember one day she was like, people won't stop messing with me. Oh, y'all know she was talking about me. She like a little gnat. I just got my floss square. She was putting that shit on her face. And then she was like, <laughs> and then she's like, it's like when you come outside your house and a motherfucker's pissing on your lawn and you come outside and they just fucking with you sitting on your car. Man, come on, man. Farmer Nancy made fun content. To get back at her it was fun and she was sad mad and crying and she sicked her dogs on me <laughs> and that nigga said i was in the country in a barn somewhere doing bestiality i'll be goddamn oh man wow mm -mm -mm. See, if I had real male friends on this YouTube app, they would be like, you got former Nancy fuck up. Eh, 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 eh. <laughs> but I don't even rock like that. You know what I'm saying?
Shit, this happened way back in January. You know what I'm talking about? Why y'all still bringing farm? Why y'all still dragging my name through the mud like I called that man Epstein? I did not do that. I just showed y'all that I did not do that. Rainy, this is why it's up forever. Because you came up with that idea. You probably put it in his head that I called him that. And you made a play on me, bitch. Epic fail. Now look at your ass. Tell the truth, sis. Speak up. <laughs> it's fucked up. Nigga, nobody ever fuck said they didn't like you. You made that up. That was a lie. Sizzle pop. I never said that. You just lied on me. You you should have said, is this what you do if you maybe don't like somebody? I because I did. You just was stern stick down was like, This what you do when you don't like someone? I didn't never said that I didn't. I just just I'm just baffled at the way you be talking to motherfuckers on the YouTube and the shit was kind of deviant like and I was just like, God damn. I've seen islands out here in this bitch. <laughs> This nigga saying. I'm gonna be a therapist. Let's, let's work this out. Guess what? I'm pretty sure. And I'm asking him, hey, yo, sis, come up on my panel and talk to the real cornbread after he called you a child predator. Mm. Like I said, that had nothing to do with me. That had everything to do with whatever he was going through with Cornbread and his Discord. Y'all stop. No, nigga. That's your Discord. Your Discord subscribers running amok and disbanding and spreading stuff out into the atmosphere. I didn't take it and put it nowhere else. I didn't even... Sh I, when you did that, I didn't even go off and put it out there to the world that that had happened. I didn't even attack you back. Because in my mind, I was like, this bitch Rainy ain't shit. She trash. Because at the end of the day, I already knew. You know what I'm saying? Mm, 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 mm. But y'all be wanting to be out here like, Carmen, this just act like she's so fucking innocent. No, I'm not innocent. But I didn't come on YouTube to do no kind. This is some other shit. What the fuck? Right? Come up here. If I let Foreman Nancy up there, after Foreman Nancy called you Epstein, me and her cool now, right? But come up on my panel and talk to Foreman Nancy. I'm oh, thinking about the law. Bitch, we would never be cool. You, you, you shouldn't even brought my name up. You shouldn't even said nothing about me, bitch. I would never be cool with you. Ever, never. Ever, never, ever, fucking never. In life. Ever. Ever. And you're still lying. Because you're still lying. You're still lying on me. I'm going to clip that and record it and make a short. <laughs> Anyways, y'all. This bitch is out of control. I would never, I, with, as a matter of fact. I... They have to show. Don't subscribe to Homeless Life Coaches. That's the lesson for today. Uh, don't subscribe to Homeless Life Coaches. They have to pull it out. And like I just said, show a bitch where. I never fucking did that. And so. This. This right here, this how y'all get down. This how y'all get down. Hey, this, <laughs> no fucking accusation on a nigga talking about he's a pedophile and all these type of shit you do. I didn't. I didn't talk about that. It's not because Regina was right. It's because Skinny about King Webby. That type of shit. That type of shit. I'm putting you niggas' names out here. Oh, and Farmer Nancy, is this what we doing? Farmer Nancy, do we allow niggas to call other niggas pedophiles because you don't like them? I mean, do we allow grown ass men on the internet to talk? derogatory and motherfuckers say women is I mean goddamn because you got a bigger page you got a following and I need to know if this is what um farmers support I want to know if this was farmers support because I heard a lot of things about people on farms I heard people fuck sheep goats pigs heard niggas sleep with the fucking animals on farms is that is that true for you have you ever had a horse put his dick up in you? Because they do that on farms. I've seen that shit on video, nigga. Would I be able to go on one of these motherfucking woman fucking horse 
Would I be able to see a farmer Nancy on one of them motherfucking videos? Or do you know somebody that's been fucked by a horse before? You telling me you ain't hear one story of a nigga fucking a sheep on a farm where you grew up? Have you ever had a horse put his dick up in you? Because they do that on farms. I've seen that shit on video, nigga. Would I be able to go on one of these motherfucking woman fucking horse? Would I be able to see a farmer Nancy on one of them motherfucking videos? Or do you know somebody that's been fucked by a horse before? You telling me you ain't hear one story of a nigga fucking a sheep on a farm where you grew up? You ain't hear one story of a bitch getting fucked by a horse on a farm where you grew up. You telling me you ain't never heard them stories? You ain't never heard them stories on a farm about niggas fucking the animals. You telling me you ain't never heard of that? You telling me there wasn't one person ever around all these farms. You ain't here. Yo, that nigga over there done fucked a sheep before. Yo, that nigga done got caught fucking a pig. You telling me you ain't never hear not one of those stories. You a fucking liar if you don't. If you try to tell me you ain't never heard those stories about a farm. If you ain't telling me that there wasn't one, at least one person in your motherfucking life that you done heard that, heard that story about, you a motherfucking liar. Because you know what comes with living on a motherfucking farm. Those stories. Those stories come with living on a farm. So now, would you like that because I know this type of shit happens on a farm, that Farmer Nancy is the bitch getting fucked with horse dick? Because it's, it's possible. It's not like you could say, that could never happen. Yes, it can happen. Nigga, bitches on farms fuck horses. Fuck you mean. Are you one of them kind of bitches on a farm that fuck horses? That's all I'm saying. You wouldn't, oh, okay. Well, hey, you in the chat. <laughs> you seem like you seem like you okay with this type of shit. You know what I mean? And uh shit, man, listen. Anyway, anyway, this what they promote. This what they promote. I'm saying. You fuck around, you live in a barn. <laughs> oh man, listen, listen, Linda, listen. Bro, it's not like it ain't a thing. And mind you, it's not a thing for a nigga like me who is in a city or a woman that's in a city. Why? Because we don't got no fucking farm. People that fuck animals and horses and shit like that. They're not people like me because I don't have access to that shit. But people like you who got access to that shit might try it. So it's not like, even, even when I'm speaking on it, nigga, you can't put it on nobody like me. Nobody around me, nigga. But I could definitely put it on you because I search right now with a woman fucking a horse and I bet you it's nothing but barn videos and farm videos. They ain't fucking a horse in no city. These horses ain't fucking these women in no motherfucking um, suburbs. They out on a motherfucking farm, nigga, in the middle of nowhere. Fucking horses. Fucking sheep and fucking pigs. On acres and acres and acres of fucking land. So it's places where you from that people fuck horses. That women take that horse dick and put it in their motherfucking vagina. It's places where you from. And if you Google it right now, all you're going to see is farms. You ain't going to see no motherfucker on a city street getting fucked by a horse. Every time you see that shit, it's going to be on a farm, Farmer Nancy. So don't try to tell me that you don't know that women on farms are fucking horses. I just hope that you ain't one of them, but I can't say that you ain't. You love that farm so much, you probably love them horses. But anyway, this type, this type of slander is unacceptable. It's unacceptable. But I'm going to just let it play out so y'all can hear all the fuck shit they were saying. And then I'm going to move on. Mm. 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 Mm -mm -mm. This one's for you. The rules are the no, Don't worry about the rules, okay? We're not gonna play by the rules, all right? Here, no, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do the Big Sean song. Wait, wait, we are? Yeah, Mom's working on it, okay? So yes. I'll follow your lead and you- The, the moves are the same, right? The whole- Yeah, yeah, are we, yeah, the moves you, okay. There it goes. Okay, we gotta go, we gotta go. Let's go, let's go. Go, 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 go. Trisha, this song is for you. I don't fuck with you. You little stupid ass bitch, I ain't fucking with you. You little, you little dumb ass bitch, I ain't fucking with you. I got a million trillion things that I'd rather fucking do. Alright, fuck it, that's what we're doing, alright. Then I be fucking with you. Little stupid ass, I don't give a fuck, I don't give a fuck, I don't, I don't, I don't give a fuck, bitch. I don't give a fuck about you or anything that you do. Don't give a fuck about you or anything that you do. I heard you got a new man, I see you taking a pic. Who the fuck I see you calling out? 
fucking do. Okay. Music stops. Then the beat fucking with you. Yep. So stupid ass. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. Yep. I, don't, I, don't, I don't give a fuck, bitch. Yeah, I don't music. give a ah. fuck about you or anything Think. that you do. Don't give a fuck about Music's you or anything that you do. Okay. Who's the loser now, Trisha? Bully this bitch. Oh my. I was unaware of the lyrics and the strong language in that song, so I do apologize. But uh, you know what? Uh, I apologize for nothing else.